Are you ready to cut down on the time you spend doing repetitive tasks, automate your social media, and streamline your day? My name is Jenna and I'm part of the marketing team here at IFT. Today, I'm going to talk you through five applets that you can create, use, and enable that are perfect for marketers and small business owners. These have been really helpful for me and I know they'll be perfect for you too. Let's get started. This first applet sends you a daily digest based on an RSS feed of your choice. This is very important when working in marketing or running a small business because it's important to keep track of trends, what people are talking about, and make sure that you can respond to things that are actively happening in your industry. So to do this, we're going to start on the create page and choose RSS feed as your trigger service. From here, we're going to select new feed item. And in the feed URL, you can input any URL for any blog or resource that you really like that has an RSS feed. You can find that by searching it or just going on the web page. And there's often this little um, RSS feed symbol. So you paste it in here. And then as your action, we are going to use an email digest. And I'm going to select to have this delivered to my inbox every day at around 9 a.m. when I start work. So the entry title you can change to be based on the blog or depending on how often they post to that blog or resource, you can just change it to um, something useful that you'll recognize in your inbox. Hit create and you're done. You can give it a title and hit finish. The second applet that we're going to make is for social media monitoring. So you can use this for Reddit or for Twitter. Uh, it really depends on where people are having conversations about your brand or what you wanna know about what people are talking about. So for this one, we're gonna use Twitter as an example. So as your trigger service, select Twitter and scroll down to go from new tweet from search. Here you can input either your handle or a hashtag that's relevant to you. So here I'm going to input hashtag ift and create that trigger. Now the action service is completely up to you. You could have it send it you a direct message. You could have it phone call you every time someone talks about you online, or you could have it sent to your Slack channel, which is what I'm going to do. So I want to post to channel and I'm going to send it directly to myself. However, you could send it to your marketing team or your business team, whoever would like to keep track of these things. Create your action, hit continue, change the title if you would like, and we're done. So we're already at the third applet, and this applet is to help you keep track of when things are due, which is very important when we're working on campaigns or meeting deadlines or working towards a big launch. So to do this, I'm going to use my task management system, Asana, as the trigger service and select new task in a project. Here you enter your organization and the project name or URL and as the action service, we are going to select Google Calendar. Now, these are all the programs that I use every day, but if you use a different calendar or use different task management system that is also available on IFT, you can make this work too. So we're going to do quick add event, and you can pick whichever of the ingredients that you think are most important. So the task name has been added to this. Um, I don't care what time it's been created at. Uh, what does matter to me is the due date. So when you create this event, if your Asana task has a due date, it will schedule the event on that date. If your Asana task does not have a due date, it will schedule it for when you created the task itself. So from here, create the action and change the title if you want. For applet number four, we are going to use this to track our backlinks. And so here, we are again going to start with the RSS feed as the trigger. 
So I am inputting a link from Buzzsumo, which is a great tool for SEO strategy, backlink tracking, and social listening. So I have inputted the RSS link that I can find within my account. You can do exactly the same thing with Moz or with Buzzsumo, whichever kind of service you use. Create the trigger. And then as an action, I am going to send it to myself in Slack. so that I can keep track of what's happening and if there are any articles published. But I am also going to keep track in a Google Sheet. So I can add multiple actions as a pro user. And here I'm going to add a row to a spreadsheet. So when you add a row, the spreadsheet name is up to you. So here I'm going to say backlink tracking. And the row will be about the entry title, the URL, um, and when it was published. And again, you can add any of the details you want from the ingredient list. If you're ready there, you can create the action and hit continue. I'm going to name this one backlink tracking to Slack and Google Sheets. For the fifth and final applet, we are going to talk about streamlining your social media. So one of the most popular applets on IFT is sending an image from Instagram or from Facebook and posting it as a native Twitter photo. So that is something that you can do without even creating your own applet. You can simply go to the explore page and search for Twitter and Instagram. And as you can see, there are lots of applets that you can turn on and enable simply by clicking the connect button. Again, if you wanted one from Facebook and Instagram, you could do that as well, or Facebook and Twitter. Additionally, for pro users who can create multi-action applets, you could create one that sends it from one platform to many all at once. We have many users who like to do that when they share something to their WordPress blog or when they have a new video on YouTube. And there you have it. So those applets today are perfect for marketers, for business owners, or for anyone who runs a social media platform and want some tips on how they can streamline, automate, and reduce the time that they spend doing repetitive tasks. These have been very helpful for me, and I hope that you like them too. If you would like to enable any of these applets, simply scroll down to the description section and you can click on any of them and enable them yourself. All IFT users can enable an unlimited amount of published applets. So you can go into the explore feed and see what's out there. Hopefully you find some new ones that can help you out and that you really enjoy. Let me know in the comments if you have any other ideas or ways that you automate your social media or your business with IFT.